Hi Pisces, how are you? Uh, this is going to be a spread for you for your higher growth in the month of June. We're going to see um, what you need in order to grow spiritually. So as spiritually comes out the high priest. Spiritually, emotionally, intellectually, and physically, okay? And I will say, excuse the water here on my shirt. I was drinking some water. Um, and it got all over my shirt. I know it's a little hard to take me seriously. Um, but yeah, nonetheless, let's move forward. Okay, with hope. It was the Nine of Swords in reverse. All right, so Pisces. What does Pisces need to grow spiritually, emotionally, intellectually, and physically? What does Pisces need in the month of June to grow spiritually, emotionally, intellectually, and physically. Okay. <clears throat> Pisces, in the month of June, okay, in order to grow spiritually, Okay, we have the high priest, um, I'm sorry, the hermit in reverse. So, isolation, Pisces. In the month of June, in order to grow spiritually, you will need to isolate yourself, okay? Um, in order to grow emotionally is the hanged man reverse. So, stalling, um, sacrifice. In order to grow emotionally, you're going to have to be patient. Be patient. And sacrifice. By sacrifice, it is being patient. Okay? In order to grow intellectually, what it's telling you to do is heal. Um, because until you heal emotional wounds, you're not able to move forward, um, you know, with your mind fully on anything, okay? And physically, here what it's telling you is a knight of swords. So take action, okay? Action. Um, knight of swords is an action card. So get into action, Pisces, okay? Let, let's clarify. What does Pisces need to grow spiritually, emotionally, mentally, and physically? Spiritually, emotionally, intellectually and physically okay Pisces what I'm seeing here is to put an end to um, a jealous uh, a, a selfishness insecurities okay that was a uh, underlying energy but put an end to insecurities um, just put an end to Whatever ending happened in the past, leave that in the past, move forward. All right, Pisces. Pisces, spiritually, emotionally, intellectually, and physically. This Pisces need to grow in the month of June. In the month of June. Thank you. Hmm. Okay, Pisces. So yes, spiritually, you need to isolate yourself, um, you know, because there's an emotional block. You need to figure out what this emotional block is. You know, you could have had some a past pain um, that you're not able to move forward. Maybe you're being defensive about something. Um, so isolation, okay? Really... Um, check in with yourself. Take some time to check in with yourself, okay? And the Queen of Wands popped out again, okay? So emotionally, okay, you need to sacrifice the, the, the insecurities, the selfishness, the jealousy, okay? Um, more so insecurities, Pisces. Just put those insecurities to rest, okay? Intellectually, you know, ooh, I, I love this because you know what? Intellectually, um, I we have here the high priests, the high priestess. So 
you know, the, the three of swords, so healing, like I said, healing, you know, because your mind can't be focused on anything when you're, you know, have past wounds open. But I feel that Pisces is coming into a time where spiritually and intellectually, you are learning, Pisces, how to maneuver intellectually this, 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 these new gifts that you have, this new understanding, Pisces, and learning how to merge um, those two together. And I think that intellectually, also mentally, you are learning, Pisces, that through pain, through pain is how you heal, okay? Um, you're learning that through through your pain and, and, and how you basically transmute that energy and catapult yourself forward, okay? That is what takes you to different levels intellectually as well, okay? Love that. Love, love, love that. Okay, so here in the physical, okay, um, with the, um, the Knight of Swords, which is taking action, we have the Six of Wands in reverse, which is excess pride, uh, like a punishment, so you're not taking action, Pisces. You need to take action. Um, and it could be because you have to address some things like in pride. Maybe you're trying to punish someone um, or, or, you know, or just punish yourself in a situation. Oh, I'm, you know, kind of get in a funk. Oh, I'm mad. I'm not going to do that. But, you know, it ends up affecting you, you know, because you don't take action. Maybe, you know, you being in a funk like that, then you're home all day and you don't go to the gym, okay, because you don't feel uninspired. So take action, okay? Take action and leave the excess everything, whether it be the excess pride, you know, punishing yourself, Pisces, you know, punishing yourself for not taking action, you know, um, as well. That's another underlying thing that I'm getting is, um, you know, it's okay to take time off and, and be in isolation. I think that Pisces, it's one of the other things that Pisces is learning, that it is okay. You need that. That is a balance that you need. Um, in order to to keep yourself emotionally right, um, you know, your intuition right, in order to keep things balanced and moving forward, okay? It's okay to take time off. Knight of Cups. So, emotional, um, emotional offer. Following your heart. Let's see. What does Pisces need? Last go around for Pisces. You... You know what's so funny? As I, 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 I did these cards, right? I picked up these cards and I shuffled them and I put them here as they needed to be. And I realized now that I left one card unpicked as I, was, as I kept shuffling. And it was, again, the Three of Swords reverse. So healing. Healing. Pisces for growth in June 2019. Pisces needs healing. Pisces needs to take this time out to heal, okay, to heal past insecurities, to heal past jealousies, to, to heal past things that, that have been stalling Pisces from moving forward, okay, Pisces is learning a new way of, 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 of maneuvering these energies, new awareness, okay, and Pisces, action is needed, a different type of action than you've taken before. Pisces. Pisces in June 2019. Spirit angels and guides, please clarify these cards for Pisces. 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 Thank you. Spiritually, emotionally, intellectually, and physically okay Pisces so what I'm seeing here is yes isolation because you need to go inside and see why you are emotionally dissatisfied why you're lacking joy why is it that you're lacking joy why are these emotional blocks take time out to take a look at that um, again you know putting to rest some of the insecurities and whatnot and then taking an approach, um, a leader approach, overcoming challenges, putting to rest these insecurities and doubt about yourself and, and selfishness and jealousies and being a leader, taking control of your life, overcoming any challenges that come your way. Okay, Pisces, 
And with this healing and mentally, okay, mentally learning new things, Pisces, it will lead you to the Nine of Pentacles. It's leading you to the fruits of your labor, the luxuries, actually seeing the rewards. You working mentally and healing yourself and learning how to, you know, maneuver these new intuitive hunches that you have and whatnot and learning how to bring it all together is you're seeing rewards in your reality. It's, it's like the last bit that you needed. Like Pisces, you know, is always intuitive and, and, and emotional, but Pisces needed to balance out mentally, okay, logically in order to bring these fruits of the labor forward, okay? And here physically, um, with taking action, we have the Four of Swords reversed here. So uh, a burnout, okay? So what it's saying here, Pisces, is that yes, you know, taking action, um, you know, and in a way, well, now this makes perfect sense actually, you know, once we have all the cards out here physically, okay, action card, action, you know, um, it could be a little impulsiveness and whatnot, um, six of, of, of wands reverse a punishment and four of swords um, reverse, so stress, burnout. So Pisces, you could be going, 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 That that's also your way of, um, you have to be careful if we're wanting to, um, the reason it's important to take time out here is because you can go, 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 you know, to try to just keep going and doing and, 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 and not address these things. And that's a punishment for yourself. You're punishing yourself because you're overly, you're, you're burning yourself out. So again, we're learning that this balance here is what brings prosperity, okay? So Pisces, I love that. Again, theme of your reading, healing for June. Um, you're doing a great job of that. I think we just have to take some time for ourselves and really um, look within, okay? So let me know if that was helpful. Let me know if that at all resonated with anyone. Um, if it did, please like um, or subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.